Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna need y'all to sit back, grab some fries, open your eyes, and even maybe eat some pies. Cause today you're here to witness the rise of the no money spent that's aiming for the skies. I'm talking about that sniping where nobody dies, but instead we get caught by surprise. I'm talking about that grinding where nobody lies, but instead it takes multiple tries, man. I'm here to help you guys not only become more wise, but succeed in your franchise. I'm talking about grinding from the night up until the sunrise boys and girls welcome back to episode 21 of the no, no money, money spent, spent series, series. If you want to buy cheap and reliable MT, you guys already know where to go, man. Go to DVDJ.com and use code HTB at checkout. Hey, what's up guys? Henry the Blazing here and welcome back to episode 21 of the No Money Spent series, man. Before we do dive into this episode, I want to quickly apologize to you guys for not uploading this series in a couple days. I know I'm also lacking like crazy on the Chosen One series, which I will also talk about later or upload when I upload it. But uh, basically, I've been super, super busy this last week. I've been planning for a trip. I've been working on some behind the scenes stuff for you guys. And also, I've been trying to think and upload a bunch of creative squad builds as you guys have seen I've been uploading in the last week so I do want to apologize for being super busy with that as well as 2k hasn't really been active with locker codes and stuff like that so it hasn't really given me an initiative to really rush into the no money spend we just recently got content and a locker code so I figured it was definitely a prime time to get you guys a video plus you guys haven't gotten one in a while I know you guys love and support the living life out of this no money spend series so it's only right that I get you guys some consistent content now if you guys do enjoy the video you know what you gotta do leave a like if you guys manage to get 5,000 likes on today's video I will get you guys with another upload possibly even tomorrow that's right guys you have the chance to get a back-to-back -back no money spent so again it'll come down to if you guys can get 5,000 likes and we will but uh, let's go ahead and let's dive right into this episode last episode we had quite the sniping adventure getting ourselves a Carmelo a Dikembe a Tim Duncan a Dirk Nowitzki or not Dirk Nowitzki we won him on an auction a Julius Irving missed out on a Michael Jordan and also missed out on a John Havlicek but no big deal we've got quite the elite lineup right now and they also released some new amethyst or not amethyst but some new galaxy opals that I might try to snipe that being Jamal Crawford J.R. Smith and Draymond Green now all of them are going for a buy now except for J.R. Smith no surprise he's going for almost 200k and he's really the one I want but uh no big deal Draymond Green might be someone I want to pick up for like the small forward position and maybe get rid of Paul Pierce or Kevin Durant most likely Paul Pierce if anything but he's got the diamond contract so we will have to see another thing I am hearing that I think we're gonna decide to do today guys is go into triple threat online from what I'm hearing they have juiced the boards once again and that is only a calling for one man you guys know there's only one man that is meant for triple threat when it comes to the no money spent series and that is Galaxy Opal King Dirk Nowitzki the king of half court threes when it comes to triple threat online I haven't used the galaxy opal one and triple threat yet so i am definitely looking forward to it but uh one problem we have to deal with right away is the fact that we do not have any contracts but we do have a locker code to punch in so i'm gonna go ahead and get that out of the way and then we'll play around with the auction house a little bit form our lineup for triple threat and hopefully get some insane ball drops today all right, so right here in front of you guys, as you can see, this is the Dynamic Duos Locker Code Pack. If you guys haven't punched it in already, make sure you go ahead and do so. I'll give you a chance for you guys to look at it right now, and that chance is now gone. Let's take a look and see what the board is looking like. And there's 25 tokens, 7,000 MT, and a Dynamic Duos Pack. Now, let me go ahead and think through this, because a Dynamic Duo Pack could give us a Paul George, it could give us a Kawhi Leonard, or it could give us like a Sapphire card, but 7,000 MT, I guarantee you, I will be able to snipe something with that and 25 tokens that's not really anything crazy but it's not anything bad either so i'm just gonna drop it randomly and hopefully go somewhere we want if we get a dynamic duo pack let's pray it's an opal and i will lose my freaking mind it looks like it will be a dynamic duo pack so we'll go ahead and open it up and hope it's some fire all right 2k please be good to us if i see a galaxy opal glow this is going to be a lit episode i am saying that right now and i'm not seeing anything nice an amateur 
Amethyst Glow. I mean, I guess that's nice. I really don't know any Amethyst card. Bruh. Gale Goodrich. Holy L. All right. So, uh, yeah, Gale Goodrich, go ahead and get off this team. You'll be a nice extra 500 M tier, whatever you sell for. But, uh, yeah, you guys want to see some snipes, so let's go ahead and let's get that out of the way. I don't really see anyone I need to snipe for this lineup, except for maybe a good point guard, maybe a center to replace Tim Duncan. Kevin Love is definitely staying, because this man went off last game, but, uh, otherwise, I don't think there's anything I really need to snipe. Maybe a Galaxy Opal LeBron James, that would be a huge dub as well, but, uh, let's see what we can do. Oh, one thing I forgot to do was redeem all my MT from last episode, and it looks like things didn't really sell for that high. Derek Coleman for 3700 i'm getting error codes now keep in mind guys look when you get error codes like that and you don't get your mt just keep going and redeem it all because even though it disappears you will get all your mt back if you end up bidding on something or quick selling something so right now you can see on the top right that i'm not gaining any mt from redeeming all this but i will show you guys the solution to all of it for those of you that have had that problem and have thought something was happening simply go to like a shoe or something i obviously don't need the shoe and you go ahead and you quick sell it and now look at my mt just climb up from 9,000 and it will give you all the MT right there that you are missing so now we're at 44,000 MT and now that we actually have some MT we can actually get to sniping now one thing you guys actually suggested to me was I get myself not only a better coach but also some consumables you guys told me to try to snipe some contracts because apparently these gold packs can come in packs of 20 and you can miss out on them like right there do you see how it's uh, stacked up right there that is a pack of 20 and apparently a bunch of people snipe them for super cheap so the goal right here today is is to try to get one of those or snipe a couple of those i've seen a couple of them up on my main account all right so so far sniping them has been a little bit tough i've been playing with this filter back and forth and i can't really find one for a pretty cheap price all right so i've been holding down this d-pad for like a good two minutes now and we're still nowhere near the four hour mark all right so we're finally closing in on the four hour mark and i think my finger is about to die like this is so boring to look at because at least usually when you're sniping you see different cards all i see is the same gold contract over and over and over all right we're closing in here show me something nice here 2k i want to see something beautiful wait is that a stack that's a stack it's been up for five minutes is that a dub oh let's go that's a stack isn't it yep that's a stack right there i'm pointing at it but you guys can't actually see me pointing at it but that's a stack right there and there's none at the end here either i'm pretty sure that was a 20 stack that we just bought otherwise i just took a fat l uh let's see add to collection Wait, it only shows one contract. Did I take an L? I'm almost confident I bought 20 of them. Yes, that is 20. Let's go. Let me get a dub in the chat, boys. Is sniping contracts the wave? Hey, let me play around with the diamond contract filters. Is there any going for 20K? Because I know these things have been going for like 100K or something for a while. Oh, so it's been going for 20K for a good minute now. All right, maybe we'll play around with this filter here and see if we can actually get something out of this. Let me go to the th uh, four hour mark right now and see what price it's actually going for. And then we'll figure out a filter for ourselves and try to snipe some diamond contracts as well. There's some for 18K, one for 19K, but other than that, nothing really crazy. You can see that there is a couple popping up here in the last five minutes. This could be because of the triple threat boards because they're juice, people are pulling them. So I'm actually gonna play around with the filter a little bit here. I'm gonna go down in price. As long as things are still popping up, we're good. And it doesn't look like it is. So this is one of those things where you're gonna need the right filter or things aren't gonna pop up. Let's play with that um, maximum bid filter and see if anything pops up. 19K, so yeah, it's looking like you have to go right to the 20k mark which is kind of stupid to make it pop cards up i'm not a fan of that whatsoever what if i play around with this max bid a little bit all right so if you use the max bid filter it does help a little bit what if i go down will it still show okay so yes it will so we'll go down to the point where that 19850 one is and we'll go back and forth for a while and hopefully we can get ourselves some snipes here a few moments later have me out like a light a like a light a like a light a slap through the fight a watch for the night hey let's go let's go wait did you guys hear me oh god i'm pretty sure i gotta put that singing in my commentary i had my headphones in and i was just focused in that was like a solid three to four minutes of sniping i had the whole song going as soon as i started sniping it gets me in the zone it gets me in the zone let's go I told you boys, all it takes when it comes to sniping is some patience. That's all it takes, man. And then obviously, you'll just end up getting some more snipes. What? Wait, is, didn't I just buy this? Didn't I just... Wait, what? Is that two of them? Yo! <laughs> Whoa! 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 
Did I just- wait, is that a glitch? Is it still there? Hold up. Hold up. Hold up here, boys. Uh, maximum bid. Wait, what was the maximum bid? Wait, what? Is it all gone? Hello? What? Okay, so that one's still there. Every Wait, so can I actually raise my max bit even more for stuff? Oh my goodness, I can. You mean I possibly missed out on more snipes? Alright, so for guys that are sniping diamond contracts, let's see what the max you can actually raise your max bit is before you can actually snipe something. Alright, so it goes even higher than that. Wait, let me see if it can go all the way to like 13k. Oh my goodness, this can go as high as possible. So right there, that's one for 17 that we saw earlier. And you just keep raising it higher and you guys might be able to get a snipe. So I think the highest you should definitely go is 15 max. Because that's probably the highest value card you want to get. And there's literally one for 15k right there. Except I don't know if that's a cop or not. I mean, I don't think we need any more. I'll still toy around with this filter some more just to see if, you know, we can get some dub. Wait, does that mean I can lower this one? Oh my goodness, guys, this is such a dub for this filter. We can now lower everything, uh, set the max bid there to 15, and just keep going back and forth, because there should be the one for 15k. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna sit on this filter a little bit more, and if we can get ourselves another snipe, that would be huge. So guys, at least one bonus to you guys watching these episodes is you guys can find the filters that I'm starting to find throughout the episode. Like right now, you can see that the max bid, you should probably use a max bid when you're finding stuff. Because the thing is, look, if I take off the max bid completely, you will not be able to find anything at all. Like the auction house is so broken where it doesn't do that. But when we go ahead and raise our max bid right to that peak, you will be able to find stuff. And that ends up being such a dub, man. Like you really love to see. Whoa, what? Yo, there's so many snipes today. This just popped up as well. That's not a snipe. We just got another. I'm telling you guys, this stuff only happens on no money spent. I swear this series wants to take my voice box because you guys can hear the crackling in my voice at this point. I've been screaming way too much. We just sniped three diamond contracts. Oh my goodness. Alright, so after all that sniping, I think it's only fair we move on to players. As much as I want to snipe contracts, don't get me wrong, I'm hyped. I also want to get some players, because right now, people might really be throwing stuff up like crazy. I can't think of any position we need to replace. I mean, maybe Kevin Love. Let's see what power forwards are actually available for what price. Maximum bid, 500. And it looks like there's actually quite a bit of cards. Wait, the thing is, does this work without the filter? That's what's most important. And it looks like it... What? Anton Jameson is only... Only 27k. Chris Webber's only 20k with five minutes to go. Oh my goodness. Let me lower the living life out of this filter. 2k wants to play with me and now it's not showing anything. So now we got to toy around with this max bid once again and hope something pops up. We know there's a Chris Webber at 20k so we'll use that as a reference. Other than that I'm not really seeing anything else. So we'll toy around with the max bid again quite a bit more. Uh, I think if we raise the max bid here and lower the buy now, it should work hand in hand. Oh, it looks like it is. Alright, now let's go down to 17k where that Dirk is. Because Loki, if I can snipe a Dirk that has more contracts, I will take that any day of the week. So yeah, let me sit on this filter for a little bit and hope we can get ourselves a snipe. Alright, so now that Dirk Nowitzki is gone, so once again I got to- Oh, is that a snipe? Get that! Yo, let's go! Oh my god, that was so last second! Yo, the Dirk Nowitzki was gone, so I started toying around with a filter. That's insane. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, no, no. Yo, let's go. That's two back-to-back stops in under a minute. What? Oh, jeez. All right, we are back. My throat is killing me, so uh, forgive me for that really random screaming. But I forgot we can do this with different positions. I don't know why I was just limiting, my, limiting myself to power forwards. Yo, no, hold on. Let me sit on this for one more minute. Because that Chris Webber snipe was a huge dub. That caught me off guard. He's got a diamond shoe. So let me actually see what this card is looking like. I think I'm going to sell him. Because as soon as I saw that Anton Jameson with a diamond contract, I think this guy is going to be the keeper of this lineup. Oh my lord. I'm not seeing Hall of Fame defensive stopper, which does kind of suck. I'm seeing gold defensive stopper, which I guess isn't that bad. He's got that duo with Gilbert Arenas. I actually might try to snipe one and then get rid of John Wall. This card is definitely the perfect card to replace a card like Kevin Love, though. Just because both of them are going to be sharpshooters. 
with limitless range differences he's got ball control he's got speed like i don't know what to do i think i should sell this chris weber i'm gonna need you guys to let me know down in the comment section below i think i want to try him at least once does he at least have gold limitless range because if you don't have gold limitless range you are most likely off this team and he does not have gold limitless range yeah he's got to go i don't like paying for badges I can't believe we sniped back-to-back -back Opals. I mean, I'm kind of broke now because I only have 16k MT, but that was so worth it. Let me see what my options are for Galaxy Opal point guards first before we actually act on anything. And there is Russell Westbrook. He kind of has a slower jumper though, but he's got a duo with Pink Diamond Kevin Durant. Not the moments one, but the 20th anniversary one. So we get vetoed there with our Durant off the bench. There is Oscar, Tony Parker, and eh, Fred Van Vliet. Eh, there's a Magic Johnson for 24k and I cannot afford him. I can't tell you guys how much that actually sucks because that man would be an instant cop for my team. A 6'9 point guard? Yeah, say less. Uh, let's keep playing around with these filters though. I'm actually kind of liking seeing all these different players. We might actually find a couple snipes or two. Yep, there's nothing there when it comes to CJ McCollum's. There's a Julius Irving, Paul Pierce, Kawhi Leonard. That is not bad either. Wait, why is one popping up for 44k by now? Did I mess my filter up? Oh my goodness! I messed up my minimum and maximum. That's supposed to be down here. And this is supposed to be up here. What am I doing? So there's a Larry Bird here that just popped up for 25k. And you know who can't afford it? I can't. But you guys can see so many snipes pop up with this filter. Larry Bird and a John Havlicek for 10k. If you're looking for this card, there is a cheap one right there. But again, just play around with the max bids always. And then just set your maximum buyouts and see if you can get some snipes. Let's see if there's actually some centers. So we're back on this regular point guard filter trying to see if there's anything we can get ourselves. And there's a Westbrook for 12k and a Derek Rose for 16k. Thing is, I don't know if either of these are... I feel like that Westbrook one is a cop. Do I go for it, guys? Oh, I've only got 16k left, though, and I feel like I should use it on a legitimate, like, good, good snipe. And I don't know if a Westbrook would make my team, so I'm not gonna act on that right now. Okay, so now I can actually see it, so let me go back down. And now it doesn't show the 9,000 one. How does that make any sense? Like, what? That's the only time this one will pop up is when I don't go under 10, 350. Oh, now it does. Bro, this sniping literally makes no sense. I can't figure this out whatsoever. And low-key, it is actually kind of annoying, man. But, uh, we'll just... Oh! Oh, no! No! Oh, my... Okay, I need to go for a walk. I need to go for a walk. My throat is... I'll be right back. Yo, let me get a picture of this real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and put this video up. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. Bro, where the hell's my water bottle? I need to chug jug my throat real quick because my soul, my soul has left my body. And this is a daily reminder that you guys should be hydrating, so always hydrate. But oh my goodness, chug jug real quick and let's get back into this video. We're back. We sniped yet another three Galaxy Opals today, guys. I don't know what to say. Like, is it good that we were on that shooting guard filter? Was there probably centers and point guards up for 500 that we missed? Most likely, but it's not about the ones you miss. It's about the ones you get. I think that's how that quote goes. So, uh, Kobe, maybe Kobe should play point guard in replace of John Wall. Wait, he's got a dynamic duo with who? Oh my gosh. Oh no, I gotta start Kobe now because he's with Melo. So if I start Kobe and Melo together, that looks real, real nice. What does it even do for Melo? Yo, it boosts his defense like crazy. I forgot we still have this Pink Diamond T-Mac. And we got all these other cards that I actually need to throw up on the auction house right now. So let me go ahead and let me do that. And then we'll get ready for Triple Threat Online. Alright, and last but not least, Michael Finley, goodbye. Honestly, it hurts to sell Kevin Love, because I know that card is consistent. Anton Jameson, don't get me wrong, a lot of people love him, he's an OP card, but I'm so mixed about base 11 cards sometimes, they're so consistent, or they're so inconsistent, and there's really not an in-between, and this starting lineup is going to be a problem for everyone, but I think what I'm actually going to do is throw a diamond contract on Carmelo Anthony. He's one of those players that I don't really see leaving this team, 
he's super super glitchy and i think we're gonna use him in triple threat so i think what we're gonna rock is carmelo anton jameson and maybe dirk does that make sense or should i use someone else nah it's only right that we use dirk nowitzki man so let me give him a couple contracts i'm not gonna give him a diamond contract because i don't see him staying on this lineup forever but it's only right that we have him on the team here if we're going into triple threat online so uh lebron i'm definitely gonna miss you uh anton jameson you're gonna be a good addition and now we've got a lineup that looks like this only thing we're missing though is that hall of fame dimer to dirk but the thing is dirk is splash regardless so i think we should be okay this is what the triple threat lineup is looking like let's hope we can get out there and actually get some dubs man time for the one hour that's usually how long it takes to complete all 10 games let's get into it and let's hope we don't take any l's because we're definitely going to be matching up against better teams with a lineup like this let's get into it boys all right so our first matchup is anton jameson anthony davis and dirk nowitzki so i'm seeing that people are starting to realize who king dirk really is give me that that's baited thank you mellow start running to the basket bro everybody's getting baited jameson pump fake step oh i'm pulling that that was not even a base 11 i mean it still went down but what was that all right so off to an interesting start here as long as we stop anton from shooting threes though i think we'll be okay nice steal right there mellow all the way to the basket putting it down in transition as long as this guy's not shooting any threes, I don't see us losing this game. Uh, Mello, everybody on this lineup has limitless range as well, so that's a huge bonus. Blow by and put it down with Mello once again. Nice rebound there. Uh, let's go to Mello. Mello to my boy Dirk. Catch and shoot. Not a green, but it's a bucket. Welcome back, Dirk Nowitzki. All right, we're actually up quite a bit. As long as you stop this guy from shooting threes, to be honest, he gets choked. Because obviously, threes are the best way to come back in triple threat. And see, now he's trying to zigzag and do his whole shindig. It is not going to work here. You can go for as many twos as you want, but I'm not giving you any threes as you miss it anyways. Right to Mello, to Anton, catch and shoot. Base 11 me, mama. Good defense right there. All this guy wants to do is shoot threes. As long as we stop him from shooting threes, we gonna be all right. Dirk, catch and shoot green bean in transition. I'm telling you guys, get yourself a King Dirk. Get that rebound, Dirk. All right, now let's end this. Let me pass it to Mello and right back to Dirk from deep green bean. And that's gonna be game over for game one. 495 MT, I will take that. Let's hope we got a fireball drop here. All right, 2K, show me the money, please. Oh, a diamond contract to start the game. Hey, I'm all for it. Let's drop it right there and see where that goes. If we get that diamond contract, it's going to be a good episode today. Is it going to be? A oh, just barely. How much MT is this? 750. I mean, I guess that means we got a thousand from that full game. But uh, now on to game number two. I'm ready for like the five ball drops because those ones be crazy, man. Game number two is looking like Lonzo Ball, Jermaine O'Neal, and Scottie Pippen. So not a bad matchup, but we're clearly the dominant team here. All right, so he's seeming like the guy that's going for twos to start the game. If you go for a two to start the game, you're not it. Dirk, show him how it's done. We start the game with threes, no matter how contested they are. Keep clapping, keep clapping. He's got six seconds. Right now, we are down five points. We got to start playing a bit smarter. We're okay, we're okay. Make him take a dumb shot. There we go. Now get the rebound and let's actually push the pace. All uh, right to Dirk. Limitless Dirk, I need you. Green Bean, thank you. Good defense, good defense. No chance that goes down. Somebody get that rebound, thank you. All uh, right to Jameson. I'm stopping, I'm popping. Not a green, but it's a bucket. Thank you, base 11. All uh, right, let's keep doing our thing here. All uh, right to Anton, Anton to Mello. Dirk, I'm gonna need you to go a little faster to the basket there. Nice pass. Now get in the post. Out to Anton. Pump fake. Oh, see, this is an easy post spin right work right here. Come around. Get in the post. Post spin on him. There you go. All the way, Jameson. Nice dunk. Good defense there. Good defense. Don't let him catch that. Oh, Jameson. See, our team's not really playing defense like that, which does kind of suck. Good thing is we can catch up with a quick three. Oh, yeah, right to Mello. Mello to Dirk. Oh, next time be out at the three. You're still hitting the two and you got takeover. So I'll take that. All right, three-point game, but we do have Dirk in takeover, and that's all that really matters, man. All uh, right, to Dirk, pump fake. I'm going here, cross him up. There we go, all the way to the rim, all the way to Jameson for three green bean. All right, that worked out. He's clapping up Dirk right now. All right, he gets the dunk there, but uh, all's good here. We still got Mello, and guess who we still got? Limitless Dirk Nowitzki, green bean lightly contested. That was huge. Keep clapping, keep clapping. Where were you, Anton? Oh, that's so tough. This is gonna come down to a three. Dirk still has takeover, so let me see if I can take advantage. Catch and shoot, no way. Nope. Oh, that's tough, I, I messed up. We're gonna lose now, that was dumb. 
Go! Oh, he just dunked on my team to end it right there. So we actually go ahead and take the L. Adjusting to knowing how to use this team is kind of tough. And that guy was a super smart player. So all credit goes to him right there. So of course, on the one game we actually lose, there is a draft day pack in the corner, five tokens. Like that is so tough, but we gotta redeem ourselves on the next game, man. You can't be underestimating these opponents. All right, next opponents are looking like Oscar, Chris Mullen, and Hakeem Olajuwon. Other than Hakeem, I think we match up with everyone else pretty well. All right, let's get it going here, Melo. I'm gonna need you big time. You weren't really big that game. Is he even playing? Oh, I should've just taken that shot. Oh, I'm shooting that off the dribble. Hello, Melo. That's how we start a game. All right, so he responds with a three of his own. Uh, let's go to Anton Jameson, who should be pretty fast. Snatch back. Oh, that snatch back got to be a little faster than that, my guy. All the way, though, not drawing a foul. We still got that layup to go. I don't know what it is. Oh, that's a steal. Those are both steals. Someone grab that. Thank you. Right to Mello. Mello to Dirk. I'm going to need you big time. Thank you for that. Our team just feels like they are not playing right today, man. Nice rebound there, Dirk. All right, now let's push the pace here. Uh, Mello, get open. Uh, catch and shoot. Hello, Mello. Green Bean. Give me that ass baited. Thank you. Stopping. I'm popping. Green Bean once again for Mello. Where's Mello? Catch and shoot. Oh, that's only a two. A bucket's a bucket, though. And just like that, our opponent decides to leave the match. He didn't want to be any part of that Carmelo massacre. Let's hope we can get some good ball drops out of this one. Please be good to us. And there's a this day in history pack. I mean, that gives us a chance at a pink diamond Shaquille O'Neal. So I guess that's not so bad. I mean, overall, that board is just a full on L. Let's drop these balls and see where they go. First one decides to land on a bronze pack. That's going to be an L. Second ball drop here. Please be good to us, bro. Sometimes the ball just drops so slow for climatic effect. Oh, this one's going into this day in history. I feel it. I feel it. Oh, no. Oh, wow. As if it bounced off like that into a silver pack. Another tough matchup, this time LeBron James, Larry Bird, and Moses Malone. So I guess having a better lineup is going to make you match up with better players. Either way, let's see what we can do. Let's get in the post. Let's sauce him up to start the game. Hello, Mellow Green Bean. The only thing I'm scared of this game is going to be LeBron James. He's the only one I see cooking Carmelo Anthony. Everyone else, I think we can be okay. Get that rebound. There we go. Now let's push the pace. Antoine, I'm going to need you to run a little faster. You got 92 speed. I want to see it. Uh, let's go to Anton. So far, all he's really doing is dominating with LeBron. Not too worried about that. Oh, that's an easy pull-up right there. Easy money. Carmelo Anthony is so OP when it comes to triple threat. Let's go to Anton. Anton, let's go into a nice little pick and fade. He's going to be reaching, so be ready for that. Hit that screen all the way. Easy dunk right there. Good defense. That's a bad shot. Get that rebound. Bro, Anton doesn't even jump. Anton feels so lazy. Dirk, go off for me, please. I want this game to be over right now. Uh, let's go right to Dirk. Pump fake. Oh, I'm blown right by. That's an easy dunk. Thank you. One thing this guy is doing a ton, though, is hitting that reach button. It's actually kind of crazy. You got to be moving around a ton or he's going to reach. Just watch. Oh, he actually didn't reach there. Uh, all the way to Dirk inside. Easy dunk. I got to switch to Dirk right here because all that guy tries to do is speed boost to the rim. That's not working out for you. Thank you. You just keep reaching and let me know how it goes. Anton, pick and pop. Or not pick and pop. Catch and shoot. Easy money. Good defense right there. I don't know if that's going down. Nice rebound. Let's go right to Anton. Yo, Anton feels like he's so slow. I mean, we're popping, and that's game over. But you see how leggy he was moving there? I'm not blaming him. I'm blaming the servers. Bruh, I don't get it. I swear this game is rigged. Every time I win a game, the ball drops are like subpar. But if you lose that one game, that one game happens to be like the best ball drops of your life. And as you guys can see, I'm low-key getting better with my ball drop game. Did I want that MT? I didn't even know where I was dropping the ball, but I'll take whatever this is anyway. 750. Yikes. Second one is going to be a bronze pack. Hooray! On to game number five. Game number five, Kevin Durant, Kawhi Leonard, and Yao Ming. Oh my, Dirk Nowitzki, you are in for some trouble. Uh, this Kawhi Leonard is definitely going to be a problem. He's driving to the rim a lot. He's missing that shot. Thank you. Anton, I see you. Just catch and shoot it quick. There we go. Beautiful. Wide open. And it's going down to start. Uh, Yao Ming is going to be annoying. Oh yeah, let's push it. Dirk, I must see you get open. Catch and shoot. There we go. Green Bean, do not play the inbounds game with me. I will abuse it. Uh, right to Mello. Mello, behind the back. Snatch back. Oh, I'm blown right by. To the rim. That's an easy dunk on Kawhi. Oh, Yao Ming for three now. And he's knocking it down. This Yao Ming is going to be an issue. Right to Anton. Anton to Mello. Stop and pop. I told you not to play the inbounds game with me. Get that rebound. There we go. Now let's push it. All right to Anton. Pump fake. And now who do I go to? Hello, Mello. Bro, you got to get more open than that. Catch and shoot. Nice open spot there for Anton. Easy bucket. 
Yo, this Yao Ming is literally just doing whatever he wants with Dirk Nowitzki. It's not even fair. I'm trying to defend that as much as possible. This time it actually works out. Dirk, catch and shoot. Yao Ming is way too slow. Get in the post. Oh, Dirk, you're open now. He jumped way too early. Easy mid-range dead eye. We're really going to play off ball like this? I mean, it's fine with me. Just get my man cutting and we'll get an easy bucket right here. I'm passing it in there. See, easy bucket. You're not even defending me. Thank you. That's a steal. Oh, my goodness. Try me. Try me. Try me. Good defense. That's not going down. Thank you. Right to Mello. Anton and takeover. Say less. Catch and shoot. Green. Bean. Some people say that I've been saying Anton Jameson wrong. It is literally spelt Anton, but most people say Antoine. I'm going to stick to saying Anton because it makes more sense. Uh, Mellow to Anton from deep. Game over. All right, so we're looking at another dud here for ball drops. People said triple threat boards were juiced with a bunch of tokens and stuff like that. Yeah, I don't know where you guys are seeing that, but I'm not getting any of this. Like, I'm seeing it all over Twitter, but it's not really looking like it's happening here. But like apparently some of these MT drop spots right here end up being like 10,000, 20,000, even 25,000 MT. But instead, what are we going to get? 500. That's a big yikes. Uh, triple threat's not looking so hot right now. I feel like we should have just grinded for Galaxy, Opal, Rudy, Gay. Uh, third ball drop happening right here. We're getting 300 MT. Holy L. All right, on to the next game this time. Bob Lanier, Dirk Nowitzki, and Michael Jordan. That is such an awkward lineup. Why is Bob Lanier there? Are you really sure you want to off-ball me like this? I'm glad everyone's using Dirk because everyone knows who King Dirk is, but uh, please don't off-ball because this will be a quick game. Oh, you're trying to hit me with Limitless Dirk. You don't know how to use Limitless Dirk. You don't know the truth. This is how it's done. Pump fake, and then you go off the dribble like a demigod. Bang! Thank you, I'll take that. Uh, right to Mello. Dirk, catch this alley just cuz. Oh, what? <laughs> Dirk Nowitzki has never done a fancy dunk in his life. Hello? This guy's been trying to use Limitless Dirk and it's not working out for him. This is how it's done. Got him. Pump fake. Off the dribble again. Psych, got you. I'm blowing by to the rim. This guy's not the greatest defender. I'm just gonna get my buckets and end this game quick. All right, so this guy's starting to hit some mad off-dribble threes. That's all good with me. Whoever you're off-balling with is getting punished. Easy base 11 in transition. Easy money. Good block right there by Dirk. Get that rebound. Push the pace and pop it with Dirk in transition. Green bean. All right, going through a bit of a dry spell here where I'm just actually missing a bunch of my shots. He's not really making any good ones either. But uh, Dirk, please end this game. Green bean. Get that rebound. There we go. Now let's end this game. Mello, hello. Back to Dirk. Pump fake. Oh, yeah. I'm going off the dribble. Uh, cross him up. Got him. Oh, yeah. Dirk, end this, please. Bang! Three ball drops again. And this time there is 10 tokens. Yeah, once again, guys, I don't think they added any players or anything. From what I'm hearing, the only thing they added was the draft packs in which we missed when we lost that one game and 48 tokens. So there's no crazy like Galaxy Opal players added or anything. I'll take the 10 tokens right there. That's a dub. We still got two more ball drops here. And then we got four more games. All right, and ball drop number three is a bronze pack. The second ball drop ended up being a silver pack. I figured you guys don't want to see that anyways. So there's a bronze pack on to the next game. Oh my goodness. LeBron, Kevin Durant, and Anthony Davis. This is going to be a tough one. All right, let's get down to business here. Please play on ball. You're not? All right, Dirk, do your thing. Get me started. Hey, let's go. Nice steal right there by Mello. Uh, let's go right to Anton. Limitless range, me mama. Green bean. Only person I'm really worried about this game is LeBron once again. That card just blows by anybody. Not gonna lie to you guys. Nice steal right there. Let's go. Oh, push it to Mello. Mello all the way. Putting it down on Durant. I'm not gonna lie to you guys though. I'm losing my voice. Like my throat is killing me from that screaming with the Kobe Bryant snipe. Good defense there by Dirk. Get that rebound. This guy's not really that crazy with LeBron, which makes it a huge dub. Jameson all the way. Nice dunk. It's only a three-point game, so we got to chill. Oh, yeah. Right to Anton. Now to Melo. Back to Anton. Catch and shoot. Stop playing that inbounds game. It doesn't work. Oh, man. I got to clear my throat like every two seconds. It is actually... Oh, this should be an easy spin. This is on Kevin Durant. He weighs like nothing. Easy layup. It's going down. Let's go. Uh, let's go to Mello. Oh, right to Dirk. Clutch Dirk. I need you. Bang. Thank you. Good defense. Yo, close out on him. Come on, Anton. Oh, you're going to let him hit an open three like that? 
Where's my boy Mello? There he is. Oh my god, he almost steals it. Uh, let's go to Anton. Let's go into a nice little pick and fade. He's reaching his nuts off, so just be ready for it. Hit that screen. Uh, let's go all the way. Get in the post. Get in the post. Hit him with that spin. Get in the post. Get in the post. You got that post hook. Hit him with it. All right, if we can get one stop, we can win this game with a three. All right, we have the chance to make a comeback right here. Uh, let's go to Anton, and let's go into a pick and fade here with Mello. He's not going to see it coming. He's going to be reaching pretty soon here, so make sure he hits that screen. There you go. Hit that screen. Now, go all to Mello. Oh, pump fake. Back to Anton. Oh, he stole it. That's so tough, and he's going to win the game right there. Oh, you hate to see it. Oh, uh, there goes our second loss, and there's a Kobe pack and 48 tokens and dynamic duos on the one game we lose. We can't get all three of them. We can only get one of them, and of course that would happen when I freaking lose my game. That's so tough. Please don't give me that silver pack. If you give me that silver pack, I'm gonna be mad. All right, we get a Kobe Bryant pack. I mean, that's not bad. I would have rather had the dynamic duos, I feel like. If we pull Ping Diamond Kobe, though, that's a huge dub. Alright, on to the next game. We're dealing with LeBron and Anthony Davis with a mix of Shaquille O'Neal. This one's gonna be fun. Alright, no more playing around. Uh, size him up with Mellow. Snatch back. Oh, Limitless Mellow. Let's go off this game. No playing around. That means don't miss those shots. Yo, Mello, I'm here for the Knicks version of you, not the Rockets version of you, so show him what you can do. Oh yeah, that snatch back is way too mean on him. Easy dunk. All right, we're already down two points. Uh, Mello, turn up. Oh, there we go. This time, don't miss the shot. Bro, thank you. Clamp up, clamp up, clamp up, clamp up. You got Hall of Fame pickpocket. One thing I do like about Melo on defense is the fact that he's got Hall of Fame pickpocket. I don't know how LeBron managed to hit that, but that's LeBron James. You just you just can't stop the man sometimes. Uh, Melo, let's start saucing up. There we go. Dribble God. Dribble God, Melo. Snatch back. Oh, I'm pulling that. Lightly's say less. Hello, Melo. Shaq, I know you can't shoot. Don't you? Bro, what? I thought that Shaq couldn't shoot at all. I didn't even think he had a mid-range whatsoever. Oh, well, I guess. Mello, you're the one going off for me today anyways. So, uh, step to the right. Pull from limitless range. Oh, that went down! <laughs> Mello's going off! Pump up. Good defense there, Anton. Oh, Anthony Davis is too much of a god for you, I guess. Uh, let's go right to you. Mello, I see you. Catch and shoot. He was just the bait, man. Anton Jameson was the bait, baby. Block him. Oh, LeBron is wide open right there. He's missing it, though. All right, we got to take advantage of this and win this game, please. Anton, catch and shoot next time. Please be out at the three-point line. All righty, two-point game. Anton is just a distraction. Right to Melo. Melo, all the way, putting it down. Good defense right there. No chance that's going down. All right, let's end this game. I'm done playing. Anton from deep, open, easy. Game over boards please be good to me thank you there's a dynamic duo on the left and a diamond pack on the right this day in history in the middle i'm going for that diamond contract or diamond whatever it's gonna be first i think because if it's a shoe it could be a dub if it's a three-point shoe if it's a contract it's gonna be an even bigger dub and we miss it all right so let me try one on the dynamic duo packs now and see if we can land that oh be good to me i'm dropping it right at the corner that's where it always seems to land in this what where are you going no oh all i had to do was bounce one more and it would have been on the dynamic packs not gonna lie i want the dynamic pack more just because it could be a galaxy opal kevin durant galaxy opal magic larry bird it could be anyone but instead let's just get a this day in history pack i'm so glad my ball drop game is amazing today all right, one more for the coach. Oh, that was a bad drop. Watch this one be the one, though. All the bad drops always seem oh, to not work out. Ah! All right, so this is going to be an easy game. Steph Curry, Vince Carter, and Kareem. We shouldn't lose this. We should blow by this pretty quick. Let's go ahead and let's make this game quick. He wants the off ball. I got no patience for that. Mello, start cooking this man. Easy bucket to start. Good defense. That's a bad shot. If you scored that, I would have been high-key mad. Uh, Dirk, get it going. Once you get that takeover, it's over. Get that rebound. There we go. All right, let's keep pushing the pace. Right to Anton this time. Oh, you got to stop stepping in for these twos, guys. Dirk, please play some defense. Dirk has not been playing any defense. All right, there he actually plays defense. Mello, I see you. Just get open and shoot it. Stop asking for the ball and just do your thing, man. Hall of Fame pickpocket. Thank you. I'll take that. Uh, right to Dirk. Dirk, get open and pull it. That's lightly. It's still dropping. Good defense there by Dirk. And yo, bro, Kareem is just scoring on Dirk. No matter how good my hands up defense is, it doesn't do anything. Uh, Dirk, pump fake. Blow right by. To the rim. Please score that. Oh my goodness. If Curry managed to stop you, I would have been mad. 
Yo, guard him. Oh my god, if he hits that three, I was going to be so mad. Like, just play some offense, Anton. Catch and shoot. Let's please end this game. I just realized this is way too close of a game. Let's close it out. Get that rebound. There we go. All right, now let's end this game because he's going to be reaching. Uh, stop, step back, and pull it Anton style. Game over. And, uh, yeah, four ball drops, and this is looking like a big yikes. I think we should have really just played Unlimited. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy we got all the tokens and stuff that we did. But how does that end up all the way on that side for a silver pack, bruh? Like how? This next ball drop is gonna land on some MT. Please be good, MT. 300 MT. That's so tough. Now it's the same place where the silver pack was, so it's 100 MT, bro. We're just taking L's today when it comes to triple threat online. This is really just not it. Where's this last one ending up? Please don't be that same spot. Go to the corner. Thank you. Please be like 10,000 MT or something. Bless us because we need it big time. 500 MT. That's awesome. All right, boys and girls. Last game in. Here we go. Win or lose, we're taking it all home. LeBron James, Gary Payton, and Klay Thompson. Klay Thompson is literally a triple threat demigod, so that's going to make it kind of tough. All right, last game. Let's get it. Come here. Oh, yeah, I'm pulling that. I'm not here to play around. I want to close this out. Let's go, Melo. He's trying to go off of Klay Thompson. I'm not here to play around. I'm here to get the job done. Step back. I'm pulling from three. Green bean. Let's get this out of the way. Where's Melo? Catch and shoot. Next time, please don't be at the two. Uh, let's start pushing the pace a little bit more here. We want to finish this game ASAP. Dirk, you're the god of ending games. Start going off for me, baby. All right, one point game. He wants to continue to off ball. That's fine with me. Dirk, do your thing. Okay, maybe not off the dribble. Never mind. Thank you. I will take that. Right to Mello. Back up and pull it. Not a green, but it's not a bucket. Hello? Only person that can score today, apparently, is Dirk Nowitzki, who now has takeover. Get the stop. Get the stop, Dirk. Don't let that go down. No chance. Thank you. All right, push the pace. Uh, Mello, stopping. I'm pulling. Not a green, but it's a bucket. All right, now let's get one stop and call this a game. Good defense. Good defense. You know he wants a three big time to end this game off, so steal that, please. Grab it. Grab it. Thank you. Now to Mello. Mello to Dirk. Pump fake. Oh, let's get in the post and let me ice this game real quick. Get in the post. Oh, easy post spin. Get this man off me and game over. So this is really what we're going to get for five ball drops. After going through ten games, this is what we're going to get. I'm honestly just going to drop the ball anywhere. I don't really care about the tokens enough. I'm hoping some of those empty slots are good, but nothing here is really a dub. Alright, so we actually got 1500 MT from that one drop, so that actually ended up being pretty nice. Uh, this is another empty ball drop. Let's hope it's another 1500. Be good to us. Give us that hot spice. 300 MT. On this one, we ended up getting three tokens. Woohoo! Another empty ball drop. 1,000 empty. All right, so that one's actually not too bad. And then we've got this last ball drop, and we can go ahead and call it a day. Honestly, you could have given me that gold contract. Oh, wait, it's landing on the empty spot. Wasn't there something there before? Yeah, there was a token, so that's going to be 100 empty, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's tough. Alright, so overall, quite the journey right there. Dirk ended up using all 10 contracts that we gave him. We've still got some unlimited to do. We can win two more games right here, and we can get ourselves a generation next pack, 20 tokens, and 8,000 MT. So that's probably what we're going to try to do next episode. And then once we clear this board, we're going to try to go 12-0 and 0 and get that Rudy game. But uh, with all that being said, guys, this might have to be the end of the episode. Is there any exciting packs to open? Okay, we'll open it this day in history in a Kobe pack, and then we will call it a day. Please give us ping diamond kobe and make this episode a dub nope it's gonna be a ruby jimmy butler that's great give me a ping diamond shack and i won't be mad if we got a ping diamond shack i love the card art of that shack it would be great but no it's gonna be an amethyst so regardless of what it is i doubt it's gonna make the team uh is it isaiah thomas Yep, it's looking like it's going to be Isaiah Thomas. So yeah, we're really not getting any dubs today. Aside from sniping, which was completely amazing. I hope you guys like that part. We didn't really get any crazy packs. I'm going to open up all these other packs outside camera probably. Just to have them because no one wants to see me opening bronze and silver packs. But uh, yeah, that's going to do it for this episode. Next episode, we'll be debuting the dynamic duo of Kobe Bryant and Carmelo Anthony. So that should be a ton of fun. We also got this Anton Jameson who played great 
Hit and Triple Threat. Looking forward to seeing what he can do online. And then hopefully by next episode, all these things right here sell for a decent price. But I'm starting to lose my voice and my throat is killing me. So we're going to call it at that, boys and girls. If you guys did enjoy this episode, don't forget to leave a like. And for you new viewers, you know you got to hit that subscribe button and join the Blasian Nation. I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you all have an awesome day and take care.